guys. Welcome to Super Prime Talk Show. Today we have John Babcock, Canada's last living World War One veteran, here on the show today. Hello everyone, it's nice to be here today. We are so glad to have you here today, John. So why did you decide you wanted to be in the military forces? Well, Maddie, I'm glad to be here. Being the oldest living war vet makes a guy happy just to be alive. Anyway, what was your question? I'm sorry, my hearing's going. So, well, the question was, so why did you decide you wanted to join the military forces? Oh, well, uh, ever since I was a young kid, around 15 or so, I wanted to be a war hero. Back then, we all thought war was glorious. and uh, Anyways, I went and registered and signed up with the 146th Battalion of the Canadian Expeditionary Force in Sydenham, Ontario. Wow. So tell us, John, what happened after you registered? <coughs> a few months later, I was transferred to England, and uh, it was 1917, and I had to wait there until I was 18. They wouldn't let me fight. I joined a new battalion called the Boys Battalion for other men who had not yet turned 18. The war ended a year later, though, so I never really got into action. That was a very cool story. Now, I've heard you've been giving back to the community, haven't you? I certainly have. Every so often, I go to school in my area. And I tell them about my life during World War I and what it was like to be in the Army. It's good to educate the youth about what it was like back then, so it's never forgotten. Everyone's hard work and sacrifice will never be forgotten, John. It was certainly nice to have you on the show today. We all hope that you will keep educating the community about this subject. Well, I will, Madison, and thank you for having me here. No problem. See you later, John.